originated in China, has gone abroad and became a vital source of protein and other nutrients for people's diets throughout Asia and the world today. How exactly tofu was discovered and first cultivated is unknown, but there is one existing legend that explains how. During the Western Han Dynasty, Liu An, the grandson of Emperor Liu Bang, was eager to learn the magical art of immortality. So he went deep into the mountain to refine immortal pills. He failed to produce them, but instead, he created a pile of white and tender material by mixing soybean juice with gypsum. The product was later named bean curd or tofu. Tofu is an indispensable dish on the reunion dinner table during the Chinese Lunar New Year. Its name sounds like the word fu for fortune and happiness in Chinese. So people believe that the food can bring good luck to the family. Just as the saying goes, tofu, tofu, mouthful of fu. Tofu is high in protein but low in fat, sodium, and carbohydrates. It is dairy-free, gluten-free, cholesterol-free, and vegan. So it is popular with people who have special dietary needs and often used as a meat substitute. Also, tofu is extremely versatile. It doesn't have a lot of flavor on its own, so it takes on the flavor of whatever you cook with it. Due to its versatility and nutrition benefits, tofu as a staple of ancient cuisine since ancient times has recently become a popular material used in dishes around the world. According to a market analyst report by Grandview Research, the global tofu market size was estimated at 2.54 billion US dollars in 2020 and is expected to expand at a compound annual growth rate of 5.2% from 2019 to 2025. Are you a fan of tofu? What is your favorite tofu dish? Comment below and let us know. Thanks again for watching. See you next time.